Hey guys, it's Matt with remove-malware.com and uh, tonight I'm going to go ahead and finish up my browser security um, oh, I don't know what to call them, like little miniature tests. I have a, a list of 10 malicious URLs and I'm testing each browser um, to see how well they can prevent uh, malware infections uh, via redirects and exploits and direct downloads things like that so far my favorite and uh, I know a lot of people may not like it but my favorite is IE8 because it actually prevents a lot of exploits and it also has a built-in um, a built-in executable scanner. So if you download um, an executable um, by accident or intentionally, it scans it against uh, their OneCare product and their uh, Microsoft malicious removal tool. I think that's what they call it. Anyway, tonight is Firefox, and we're going to round up this uh, the top three with Firefox. And I'm pretty sure Firefox and Chrome kind of share the same... Um, anti-malware database but what Chrome and Firefox lack and I'm pretty sure I'm betting in the future you'll see some kind of EXE scanning or uh, zip scanning um, things that you see like on Yahoo email right now where it scans a download when you when you're when you're in Yahoo email and you want to download something it automatically scans it against uh, some I think it's some version of Norton I haven't been on there in a while but anyway, let's go ahead and load up Firefox. This will be a quick one. I'm getting these uh, browser things out of the way because I have a big, big tutorial on how to repair um, a machine that's been infected and no longer boots properly due to malware infection. So that's my next, uh, it's not even a review, it's kind of a tutorial. So Anyway, let's go ahead and test out our first link. We have, if we do a help about we have version 3.0.9 on here. And we've got 10 URLs. This is number one. And this would be a redirect. Okay. So that is not in their database. This is a redirect to a fake antivirus. Now, every user I seem to meet, because I run a business in St. Louis, I, uh, I work on a lot of residential computers, they'll always click OK and they will always think that this is their computer and it's being scanned and wow look at all the trojans and nasty stuff on my computer and this is just nothing but an animation it's just a just a web page so number one sorta gets through firefox and it's very annoying it's really hard this one wants to install anti-spyware pro so you have to close it close that and luckily, if you close enough stuff, you should be okay. I might get like one out of ten people that actually think that something's weird is going on. I'm going to close this window. This is number two. And um, I believe this one times out. I didn't mean to actually get this one. That was my mistake. This is number three. I'll grab another one. Don't worry. Number three is another redirect. Um, and it's uh, kind of the same thing. Redirect to fake antivirus. So, so far we haven't really stopped anything yet. Number four is an executable. And um, now it's allowing me to download it. Uh, number five.
Again, it's an executable. It's allowing me to download it. Number six is a horrible infection called Virut. Uh, this is what this is one of the Trojans that actually patches your executables, your system executables. And uh, when your antivirus removes the uh, virus, you're not going to log in anymore or boot. Depends. So it gets right through there. Uh, sort of weird. A lot of these were blocked earlier today. I don't know what happened with uh, Firefox. It just kind of <laughs> is not working. Um, that is number seven. This is number eight. Alright, number eight, finally, we found one. Let's go ahead and say, get me out of here. Um, you can also find out why was this site, blo site blocked, and uh, it'll tell you, you know, right here. Malicious software includes 422 scripting exploits and 20 Trojans. Yeah, that's not good. Get me out of here. Takes me back to a Google search. Number nine. Get me out of here. Number 10. Get me out of here. So far we've blocked... Uh, oh, we tested 9, we blocked 3. Um, so, not too good. Let me uh, grab another link. Hang on one second. Alright, this is link number 10. This is a root kit. And it allows me to save that. So, altogether, we've blocked 3 out of 10. That's probably the worst score I've seen. Um, of course, I can only test 10 URLs because I can't have a never ending video. And let's face it, it's not that exciting. So, um, But you can get the picture. If you watch all three of these videos, you can see um, each one, each browser blocking. Um, malicious URLs and downloads. That's Internet Explorer 8, uh, the latest beta of Chrome, <clears throat> and uh, Firefox 3.0.9. So uh, that's pretty much it. I'm going to go ahead and kind of wrap this up. Um, you can find me at remove-malware.com and also check out our forums, which are growing like crazy now. It's uh, remove-malware.com slash forums. And um, if you want to send me an email, I have like a two-day turnaround now. Um, it's kind of busy for me right now, so got a lot of clients at this point. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up and get busy on my uh, tutorial on how to uh, fix a machine that has been crippled with malware. So I'll talk to you guys later.